The Pueblo Indian tribe in New Mexico is accusing the federal government of a discriminatory double standard after a medical cannabis patient's garden on tribal land was raided while marijuana businesses across many states operate without interference. The Bipartisan Attorneys General of Arizona, Connecticut, North Dakota, and Vermont sent a letter urging Congress to emphasize federal-state cooperation in any plan to legalize marijuana. A study concluded that ingestion of human feces containing THC may lead to marijuana toxosis in dogs. State news. A New York senator sent a press release about his bill to add transgender and non-binary people to the marijuana equity program. Tennessee representative tweeted about touring a hemp and CBD business. Also Tennessee, the Medical Cannabis Commission will meet on December 10th. Science and Health. A study found that recreational marijuana legalization increased the clearance rates for violent crime overall and aggravated assault, but that the positive effect of legalization appears to shrink over time. A study suggested that psychedelic use may casually influence medical physical beliefs, shifting them away from hard materialism. Business news, Vaseline, that trusted old favorite, has released a new hemp infused soothing product. In culture news, the Deftones launched a line of marijuana products. CNN will air the sixth installment of its weed series this Sunday. This has been your Cannabis News Update. I hope everybody had a great holiday weekend. Fun time had by all. You can hear the Cannabis News Update on great stations all across the nation. Flex 103 FM in New York City. 365 Jams in Montgomery, Alabama. And Blaze 420 AM in Oklahoma City. Let's get back to the music on these great stations.